On Saturday, it's Madeleine McCann's birthday. She'll be four. She's been missing for six days now. In Portugal, her parents, Jerry and Kate, who's originally from Liverpool, today thanked everyone involved in the search for their daughter. In Liverpool, her grandparents defended her parents against suggestions that they shouldn't have left the toddler in the apartment while they ate at a restaurant yards away. Why would you think something like this would happen? You make a decision, you think it's okay. And this time it wasn't. And Kate and Jerry have to live with that, which is dreadful. They don't need pressure from people saying that they made a mistake. They know this was a mistake, but it wasn't child neglect. It wasn't not caring for your children. Kate and Jerry's children are the most important thing in their lives. I'm proud of my daughter. I'm proud of the choice of husband. He's excellent. He's a really good, caring father. He plays with the kids. He looks after them. Takes his turn. You couldn't get more protective from me than that. The family also revealed how important media coverage of the case is to them. The media coverage is really the only tool we have at the moment and, and our hope for, for finding out where Madeline is or for keeping Madeline in the public eye because I think it is the public that we're going to, to rely on to get information. Prayers for Madeline and her family have been said at Kate McCann's old school at Everton in Liverpool. As Madeleine's family here in Liverpool wait for news, Portuguese police have widened their inquiry by launching an internet appeal in Portuguese, English and Spanish. And two psychological profiling experts from the British Child Exploitation and Online Protection Centre have flown to the Algarve to help local officers there. Andy Gill, Northwest Tonight, Liverpool.